Greetings and welcome back to Satisfactory. I'm Catherine of Sky and I'm very excited to be moving forward. Let's see if we have enough stuff before we leave real quick. Um, we might need... Oh no, we're good on those. I was just thinking about we need to go and improve the power production. Um, and since it's quite a long distance away, I didn't want to go the same route. We're going to try to go a little bit different and maybe explore some stuff on the way there instead. So hopefully it will be an interesting journey. We do have our weapon. We have some healing stuff, thing imagings, so it should be okay. I'm going to try to go down this area. And um, with the shoes, though, we should be able to travel really quickly. Uh, okay, let's just take that little thingy. Oopsies. I really would like to have a ramp to go on with that thing. I hope that gets added to the game. All right, so we've already bypassed the poison area, I believe. So we're going to go this way and maybe look at stuff over here. Now, what is that over there? There's cool stuff around here. But yeah, that is our mine for Katerium over there. Oh, there's a there's a tree with some fruits on it. Uh, I'm going to try to look for also some of the items that are needed for those um, med medicinal inhalers as well. And I kind of want to look and see if there are any caves around here. I'm not really sure if there are. There might be. We'll see. Well, oh, there's a little bit of lag. I've noticed it's a it's a common feature as on I think it's on Arc as well, where you change zones. What is this? Sam ore. All right, we can get some of this. Um, whenever you change zones, there's a little bit of lag delay thing. So um, yeah, it happens. Chop chop chop. Yeah, there we go. Chop, chop, chop is done, done, done. Okay, can't quite get up there yet. But I would really like to find some berries. Oh, can't get up here either. No. It'll be fine, though. It'll be fine. That has not respawned yet. <gasps> Ooh, what is this way? I want to look this way and see what's in this interesting structure here. Kind of like, oh, there's a mushroom. Hello, mushroom. Oh. Right, we just want to look for a path that does not involve our imminent demise or getting stuck. These are interesting, like little standing stones. There's a bunch of bacon mushrooms in here as well. There we go. Oh. Oh, there's more Samora here. Huh. Of course, I don't think this is actually usable in the game at this point, but I'm sure it will be. Uh, at some point in the future, because obviously it's here for us to collect. Uh, though I guess if we are allowed to build little shelving units, we could put a rock or two and just display it like a tchotchke. It would be fine. All right, let's see how much we get from this little thingy-majingy. Unless this is a mineable. Could it be mineable? Or is this just a node? Is it big? I kind of wonder if this is mineable, actually. So we're able to make a take a whole bunch from this thing. Though we are only getting two per piece, so maybe it's kind of a big but normal node. <coughs> Excuse me. There's a whole bunch around here. So maybe this is actually a proper node and not just a... Or a proper mineable thing and not just a, a regular node. There's another one here, I think. Is that Samor? Ooh. Oh, this is. Wow. Okay. Ha ha. Ha ha. I thought it was this. No, it's actually this. Wow. Wow. It's in a it's in a place. I wonder if we should put a beacon here. Oh, there's a bacon mushroom. I thought I thought those little I thought this was the Samor. <clears throat> it's fine. It's fine. We all make mistakes. It's okay. I wonder though if the ceiling clearance is high enough. Or if we might have to use explosives. Because we have seen stuff that is actually within things like green power slugs or purple power slugs that are within rocks. I think I'm going to use a beacon. I've never used a beacon before. Can I use this here? Yay! Okay, can I do anything with it? Beacon name, Sam or Okay, good. Did that save it? Or did it screw it up? Yeah, we did. Okay, it's good. Thank you. All right, that was logical. That was good. I like logical stuff. 
Uh, of course, I've completely lost where whether we're going in or out of the the place right now. Oops. Okay, looks like another boundary crossing thing. Another bacon mushroom over here and there. Bacon mushrooms are great. They really restore a lot of health. Okay, what do we got here? We have a dangerous plant there. I wonder if it's guarding anything. Yes, it's guarding this iron. So let's race to it and hopefully kill it. I still hear one flying. There it is. There it is. Oh, jeez. There we go. Aha! Oh, there's another one. Okay, so we only ended up killing one of them, I think. Okay, we have pure iron here. Is there more? So that's one. There's fruit. Nuts, I mean. Nuts, berries, fruit. It's all the same thing. We all know it's the same. Let's get the carapace. Anything else? There's another node something. There's something there. But I don't, it's not a node, I don't think. Nope, this is just flora. What are you? Limestone. We don't care about limestone. We have mountains of limestone. We do not need more. Uh, I was looking for a bacon mushroom, I think. But I've completely lost it. That might have been the one. Um, of course, it might end up that we get completely lost. And then we have to find our way back home before we can actually get to the... Um, Huh. The power plant area. But that's okay. That is okay because we're making rotors and we're making stuff for the future. I.e. Um, unlocks for the tech right now in our factory because it is running. I like that you can hear the power off thing when you're not in the factory. I'm glad we have... Oh, hello. What is this? It's, it's a Mercer Sphere, I think. These talk to you if you wait long enough. They're kind of creepy. Hello. Greetings, Mercer Sphere. Will you deign to speak to us? I strongly advise you to harvest this specimen. <laughs> oh yes, I know you do. I know you do. Okay, I forgot if I talked to them earlier. I think I might have talked to them earlier in the series. Oh, blame my memory on that. I don't know what you need them for, though. I'm going to leave that one here, I think. Let's collect the mushrooms that we need. I don't remember if this is out or in. It doesn't matter, I guess. This is probably where we went in. Oh, this is great. We have a, a really nice lake here as well. I wonder if water is going to be used for anything. Like for processes or something. What the heck is that? There's a cube on top of that thing. Or is that just a funny looking rock? I don't know. I want to find out. All right, we're gonna go fi find out and then we'll we'll find our power plant, which is over there, <laughs> I think. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. It'll be fine though, it'll be fine. There are things worth exploring here. Oh, there are dangerous things over there. Okay, what is that, that red thing? I don't know what that is. There are so many enemies protecting that red thing. That is very curious to me. There's another enemy there. Okay. Oh, it's not a cube. But there is uh, something there. What is that? Should I just... Oh, there's a crash site here. Jeez, whenever I get out of the water, I feel like I'm like two feet high or something. It feels so... Like I'm so low to the ground perspective in the game. It, I, I feel like that in all first-person type games. It's really funny. Circuit boards. Hello. What are you about? What do you need? You need 30 megawatts. Alright, can we make that? Let's see. Let's try to build a biomass generator. I don't know how much they produce. 20. So we need two. Boom. Boom. Power. Boom, boom. Oh, wait. Nope. Ha! 
That's funny. These can only have one connection, so you cannot connect them to other things. Boom, 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 and to you as well. And then they need something to run on, which will be probably this biofuel. There's the circuit board. All right, um, we had some. Good, good. Yes, yes, take it. And then the other one. Take, take. Oh my gosh, breakfast is cooking in the background of my universe, and it smells so good. Wow, the meow is real. Take it, man. Ooh, hard drive. Hello. And then we'll just delete these guys. Get our biofuel back, all the things back. What else is scattered around the, the ground here? Oh, there's some screws. Don't really need those. We can drop stuff that... Oh, another circuit board. I think those are probably valuable since we haven't seen them yet. All right, so there's a thing up there. There's a thing also over there. There's also a thing over there. Um, that's a dangerous thing. Those look less dangerous. Um, I'm going to be really sneaky and I'm going to just be safe. So let's put the foundation in the direction of the rock. Here we go. And get ourselves, change out the hot bar a bit. Uh, and we're going to do walkway ramps on number five. And crossings on six. And depending on how light goes. Really? Like, why would I want to do this? Come on, come on game. Come on game. Like, seriously. I don't know what <clears throat> the detection area of one of those animals is, um, or what the z-axis detection of it is either, so uh, we'll have to see, but luckily we've got boots on. Okay, let's see, can we get up here? Mm, maybe. <gasps> no, it's a dangerous thing! Oh god. Can I please? Up! Up! Oh jeez. Oh, is there anything up here worth having? I don't think so. I think it's all danger and death. This is not ideal. I'm gonna hop down here, and we're gonna find our ladder, so we don't totally, completely die, uh, which might be a difficult ask. Uh, let me go and get my berries. Nuts, I mean. Um, Xenobasher. Ready to bash away, bash away, bash away. Hello, hello. Wow, there are several here. This could be extremely dangerous for me. There's one. Oh boy. There's another one. And the other is there. Are there any others? I hear it. There it is. Whew. Right. Haha. <laughs> I did not die. This is a good thing. All right. Now then, I don't think I'm going- well, I should retrieve this letter. There's nothing up there. <clears throat> yep, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> I want to get back to our um, original plan here of uh, going up that cliff. I think I need to get a beacon for the cliff as well. Because I'm now a little bit um, uncertain where it is. I mean, I know it's going to be on the right somewhere, but I don't know exactly where. Oh, is that the bridge that we know? Looks like there's a slug up there. <clears throat> but I think we're quite far from, from where we need to be right now. So... There is a slug there, but I haven't had any need to clock stuff, overclock. The power is a good thing to overclock. Also, the mines are a good thing. Okay, I recognize those waterfalls. Those are the ones at the very end of stuff. Is this a mine? No. Nope. We're just, um... Ooh, hello. There's another Mercer Sphere here. Hello. Alright, we're not going to talk to this one because we're just feeling unfriendly. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's more like... I don't know what they're used for, and I don't know if they have to remain in situ or if they're a material for something or not or what. What is that thing? And also, I don't know about these birds. What to do with those guys yet. Alright. Um, we need to go around this cliff, I think, to the left. There's lots of water here. Oh, a doggo! 
Hi. I'm not gonna scare you off, little doggo. Sorry. I don't have any berries for you, though. It is most unfortunate that I have no berries. But it's okay. We found where another doggo lives. That will be enough for us. There's our stairway. Yipperoonies. Yay. Is there a, a thing up here? Oh, I thought it was a, an ore node or something. Alright. Go back up and then we'll go with our power plants. Yep. Okay. Going up here. Surprised that some of these nuts haven't respawned yet. I would have thought this is far enough away for them to respawn. Can we extend this a bit? No. Not really. Like that, please. Wonder if that would impede this angle. No, I think it would be fine. Okay, we're good. But that was a fun adventure, at least. It made it much better than me just saying, Greetings and welcome back to the episode. I have now, through the magic of YouTube, gone up the hill. No, we wouldn't have had the adventures we had. This is much better. Okay, let's go up, up, up. But I think we also need to get the scanner scanning more fun stuff too. Like, I know there's oil in the future uh, and there are other things. I think I'm going to get rid of this coal belt. We do not need this at all. So let's take this off and all of the stanchions here. Conveyor poles. There we go. Right, these guys are working full tilt at the moment. So let's go ahead and add 10 more of these plants. Now I believe, um, so I was talking to Avon and he had calculated that each of these coal power plants at full tilt uses, uh, I think it's 11.1 .1 coal per minute. So we can divide that with the number of coal mines we have. We have three mines here. We only have two miners placed, but there are actually three of them. There's one, I think, around that area right there where the pointer is. Um, so we just need to keep track of that, uh, how many we're using per each one. We are having, we do have a buffer system, which I don't think we actually need a buffer system, but we'll see. Anyway, uh, let me go ahead and we're gonna place the coal generators. We'll put this on the hotbar, I think, just because we need them. So coal generators, put that on number nine for now. All right. And we probably just need to redo the entire system of stuff. Okay. And we may also need another uh, huh, lookout tower to stand on. So we're just going to place as many as we have materials for. Actually, what we should do is this. We need to go. We have three mines that are producing or can produce 120. So that's 360 divided by 11. It's 32. We can have 32 um, <laughs> buildings up here or almost 33. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's build just as many as we can because that's a lot. So 33. We, can, we don't have enough materials for 33, but we can build a fair amount of them. All right, nine, let's go. Is this the right alignment? It looks to be so. Yes. Good, good, good. We just need to figure out the splitting on all of that. And of course, once we get the better miners, it'll be even better than that. I think I'm going to put them quite close together. Maybe I should even... Should I tear them down? No, I'm not going to tear them down. I will just put them as close as I can, because in reality, we're really not going to be walking past these things. And I believe there should be plenty of room to make the splitting on the sides. That'll be okay. Remember to go all the way to the edge here. I haven't even looked up yet. I have no idea where I'm going. Aha, we're going toward the plants. Hello, plants. But I might go from the other side as well. Let's see. How many are supported by each? Let's see. 120 divided by 11 is 
almost 11. It's 10.9. So that, let's put them to say one mine per each line. Okay, so this is one, two, three, four, five, huh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow. Okay, so we just need one more on this line. Oh no, I fell down. <laughs> Dear me. That was just silly. Okay, where's the ladder on this thing? I've forgotten. There it is. Oh, you know what? We'll just run all the way to the end and then we'll add another one. Okay, good, good, good. And it should be really easy to get these going. Um, I don't know how much on the... Okay, we have 85 reinforced iron plates. I guess for most of the journey, it's going to have to come on those reinforced iron plates. The... Uh, the coal. Okay, so here's our 10 or 11 in a line here. We can do quite a simple delivery system with this. We just need our mergers, splitters and mergers. So we'll do five and six again. I wish I didn't have to reconfigure my hotbars every time. The meow is real. I am meowing officially. So let's get rid of, uh, well, <laughs> let's place stuff down so stuff doesn't immediately die. We're just going to have a very, very simple thing here. And if I were using foundation, now this is a place where I kind of think I would like foundation just to have regular um, placement of these conveyor splitters. Oh no, that's the wrong way. That is the wrong way. Five. We need to have it this way. That's the way we want it. There we go. That's the wrong angle. Wait, what is the right angle for this? Is it that one? I think it might be that one. All right, so we're going to put it as close as possible here. And then this gets the slowest belt that it can. All right, I'm going to try to place these from here and see if that makes a difference. There we go. So the last ones only are going to need the slow belts, so that's okay. So I guess about halfway down, we can start using the slow belts or the slower belts. Why is this at a weird angle? No, it must be the weird angle. Must be the right angle. I guess that's symmetrical ish. Okay. Because admittedly, it really is much easier with foundations. Um, and I acknowledge that absolutely, but I just didn't want to build with foundation. So one, two, three, four. Uh, okay, that would be five. I'm counting because we need to have the first six. Let's see, that's one. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, and then the rest can be joined with, I think, the uh, the other belts. Going to the five is fine. Okay, and then the rest need to be the Mark II belts. There we go. Hmm. So this... We're going to go ahead and replace, um, say, number seven, eight, eight with the Mark II belts. So eight, come this way. There you go. We have, huh, we're not going to have enough. And then each individual one can be uh, replaced there. Okay, five. has to align with that one. Mark two. Go. Oh, no, I didn't want that. Um, factory is going to shut down in a minute. 
just get rid of these things. And oh, we're gonna have so much coal. What is that? Oh, there's probably coal in there because I can't pick up all of it. Yeah. E what is in here? Yeah, it's just too much coal. Put some of the coal in here instead. Oh, that's Samor. Never mind. Can I put coal in there? No. Ha! <laughs> it's just like, nope, sorry. But we can make a box or two. Um, uh, at the moment. Okay, let's just take this off. I don't want stuff to die right now. There we go. Let's put, put that there for now. Uh, we do actually need to make this a tier 2 belt. But I'm going to save the tier 2 stuff for um, the connection one first. So what I'm going to do is this is a temporary solution at the moment until we get all the things aligned. I did not think about the tier 2 belt at all. Um, which was my bad. But yeah. Oh, I could have left that one there, there. Darn it. Okay, five again. I'm kind of glad that it, like, doesn't make you take all of the coal. That's a really nice thing. Eight. Okay, mark two. There we go. Control. Okay. Alright, so this is getting basically just filling the coal generators and we are generating more power, I think. Oh, no, we're not. No, we're not. Oh my god. <laughs> that was almost really bad because, um, yeah. We don't actually have these hooked up to power yet. Okay, this one connects to there. This one will connect to these two guys. another apparently I'm slow for some reason I don't know why it must have accidentally hit the shift key power please please oh you're already connected aha ah, never mind then it's fine um that one is connected there we need these two guys to be connected here then actually we can put down a fancy power pole and have all three connected um because unless we get higher level or higher tier miners we can't support any more on this line so that's gonna be just fine okay good how much power are we generating let's find out lots of we're making lots of uh tons and tons of power right now so this is good this is feeding these things uh even though it is not connected properly yet um, what I want to do is we need to, let's see, get rid of this belt and then get rid of this, probably the whole thing actually, now that I'm thinking about it, but let's see, how much does an eight cost? Belt is too long and it also costs 66, which is not ideal. Um, so we're going to need three. Actually, it's uh, that's fine. Well, that's fine. We will organize this better later. All right, so that one is connected. We just need to remove this belt. Ah, nice. Okay, it's just removing all the coal so we don't have to have it in our inventory. Life is better. Good, good, good. And we don't need any more of the... Um, yeah, stuff. We have a lot of stuff in our inventory. What I want to do is I want to make another box to just put inventory items in. Um, it's Q. Uh, organization. Personal storage box. We'll just make a couple of these. Store all. 
store all except for coal. Thank you. And then we're just going to grab all. Okay, and then again, there was another box here. Grab all. Whoa, okay, thanks. I didn't want those bits, those bits and pieces. No, no, no. Okay, we'll put them in here then. Shove them in there, and then we'll put the coal in some of these machines that don't have any. So, oh wow, ha! There's a whole bunch that don't have any. All right, what we're gonna do is something different then. Let's see, can we go all the way to the end maybe? And at least give it partial coal? There we go. Because I need some room for some materials in my actual inventory. Here you go. Okay, there we go. Um, that one doesn't need it. This one kind of does. Just want to free up some inventory space. Just slightly. But anyway, this should eat an entire belt of coal eventually. Uh, I think what I will do is I will add a merger right here. This is six. Missing iron plates can't afford. Yep, yeah, that's what I thought. Um, yeah. We'll just have to transfer all this stuff later. Sort iron plates and rods, I think, for that, right? We do a six. Yeah, yeah, it's, it seems to be okay now. And I'll just add this here, and it will automatically merge stuff into the uh, the line, just like we did kind of in the factory that we were just working on. There we go. Is that right? Ish. Oh, jeez. My WASD got confused there. Sorry. Okay, let's just take this off. We have now more coal in the inventory. Uh-huh. No. No, I meant F. Not, not sword slash. No, no. Okay, let's put that there. And a conveyor belt going into the merger. Thank you. And we're just going to... Uh, you know what? We're going to take the conveyor belt off for now. And we're going to dump all, and then... Oh, wow. Wow, it can't even take everything. It's kind of rough. Well, that will help it do stuff anyway. Can I take this? Yes, I can grab all that. Dang, I can't believe I need two thingies for this. Alright, that's fine. We will just solve this problem. It is fine, it is fine. Hello. Hello? No, no. There we go. We'll just store all and then grab the stuff that doesn't belong, like these things. And then we're going to do some fun things with conveyor belts. Like... Like... Let's see if I can just maybe put one of these uh, stackable thingies. Can't afford... Wow. Really? I have literally run out of concrete? Oh jeez. <laughs> oh, we, we still have some here. Okay, let's uh, store all. Yes. Let's get rid of this and this. Ooh, we can't take it all. Huh? No, no. Come on. Give it back. Thank you. Okay, good. Now we should have more. Yes, we have more concrete. I knew you never leave home without it. Take your concrete with you. Uh, all right. Four... And just do this maybe ish there. I hope that will help. Hello. This way, please. This side. There we go. And go into this thingy. No, you don't want to do that? Oh no. Huh. Hmm. Sad is real. Um, let's just take this off. And go further, maybe. Let's go maybe here. work. Yes, from that side. Yes, from that side. All right. The life is better. Yay. So now we have a little bit of an elevator here. This is Sam ore. This is coal. And more coal. And probably we can put this more coal into that coal. Yep. I think we got a lot from that belt that we deconstructed from the other miner over there. Okay, so now 
the the thing is going to be to upgrade this belt to mark two so i think we actually have I don't know. We really need to just upgrade it to Mark II so that this is a fully functioning power plant. Uh, we do have materials for more. I'm thinking we should just place them down. Oh my gosh, look at this paleberry plant. We need to research paleberries because we don't actually have them researched yet. And I'm wondering if we should have... Uh, should we plow over this landscape with a second group of these um, things? Or... We can start just building this way toward the mushroom grove this way uh, and build another group here perhaps this is such a beautiful area i really don't want to spoil it you know um on this side we have these trees what's beyond the trees we have a lake we could put them i don't know it seems a shame to cut down the trees in this enemy the trees I mean, in this enemy, ha! Huh? In this game, the trees are not the enemy. We know, wow. I didn't know these trees had, had bacon mushrooms. This is very nice. I'm gonna take a picture of this because this is fascinating. Hello, bacon mushroom. In fact, you know what? This is such a good thing that I want to um, unequip my sword for this because it's nice when you don't have to have the sword in the pictures. So we'll just like focus, boom, life is better. And uh, that might end up becoming the screenshot for the thumbnail. We'll see. I don't know. That was kind of funny, though. But uh, I am also quite impressed with our our huge, huge amount of, say, these uh, power things. Oh, let's... Again. This thing is... You know what? People don't do that. They do not walk around carrying the sword facing upward. That's To me, that's quite silly, actually. Um, let's take a picture of all these glorious power plants. This is great. But it's like, you know, why would you do this? And it restricts your viewpoint as well. You don't walk around like this. You'd probably have the thing sheathed for one thing. Um, but yeah, anyway, it's a thing. Okay, so we have this done. We need to go back. Uh, do we? Oh yeah, we were looking at future sites for stuff. Oh, there's a... There's a dangerous plant there. I wonder if I should try to kill that. We do have a weapon for it. It does poison us. We could try to kill it. We've never killed one before. Okay, let's kill it. Let's try. Nope, it is not killable, apparently. Back up, back up. It did not emit the poison. Do we need to kill the top of it? This is really... Oh, wait. It's uh, blooming. Now the poison comes. All right. Okay. Bad, bad, bad KOS. Bad KOS. The thing is, is if we put stuff here, we'll save on belts for sure. Wow, that's a huge poison cloud. Um, but <laughs> we will destroy all the nature, which is not ideal. Already got that one. So if we build kind of in this open plane, that's going to be a lot better. And we'll also get this viewpoint here. So I'm wondering if we should just build out here. Hello, mushrooms. Oh, these are flowers. Right, okay. Um, this might actually be a lot better. Okay, let's put a lookout tower here. And I just want to use up the... Um, the stuff that we have. Okay, so let's put this next to the trees. This is such a lovely flat area for power plants. It is amazing. And the amount of coal you get is also equally amazing. So I think we could have one stretch going there and one even maybe on the other side as well. Uh, so let's just start with these things. Nine. I think we'll have the coal coming in from the left, from the right hand side as well. Okay, this looks like the right alignment for this. I'm just going to put this as close as we can here. And let's basically use up the frames and rotors that we have. So this will be ready. So we don't have to like, oh my god, I ran out of materials again. And we might build all the fun stuff later, all the whole um, 
mergers and splitters and thingy jings and all that stuff. But this is going to be a massive factory. I mean, massive amount of power. And then the challenge is to use all the power. <laughs> but that's what we like doing best, isn't it? We love building all the stuffs. Okay, we're out of rotors. Okay, so that's it. That's it. We've made, let's see, count the red lights. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Wow. <laughs> this is great. This is absolutely great. We might have some issues feeding stuff. Did we put it the wrong way around? Jeez. Yes, we did. But you know what? We're not going to have issues feeding stuff because it'll be fed from the other side. <laughs> that is my solution to this problem. Yes, it will be fed from this side, not the mushroom side. It'll be fine. See? See, that's how you make things fine. You just make them fine because you decide that they're fine. Yes. And we are having no problems with this whatsoever at all. Uh, I am going to leave this merger here, or splitter here. It's um, not needed at the moment, but if we are able to extend the coal lines, for example, with um, the higher capacity miners, miners mark two, higher capacity belts, um, and higher capacity everything. What are we doing on power here? Holy fuzzy cats, what do we got here? Can I click on something? Oh, I'm trying to do this stuff. All right. Capacity 550 megawatts. Okay. So we are, we're doing really well. <laughs> this is great. Anyway, I think this is a good end to our episode. Thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.